Hello and um, welcome to... Um, I harvested a bunch of barrels a, a while ago and washed them and I was going to get out here and show you how to do them and um, life happened and they dried up. And now if you want to take your wife into your hand, you can still get in there. But um, looks like the seeds inside got moldy. Uh, let's, let's do a close up of this. Okay, I cut open the old dried out one and it was indeed moldy inside because the seeds had, I watered the thing. It didn't dry on the bush or the cactus. It um, had dried and some of that water got inside and some of the seeds got moldy. So if I was starving to death, I would wash this mold off and eat, probably toast them really well and maybe even grind them up and eat them anyway. But I'm not starving to death. So what's going to happen is they're going in the compost heap and the birds go in there and peck away and clean things like this up. And I have a little baby cacti sometimes in the compost heap and they get transplanted. But counter and I processed some creosote tea, which is a whole other video. Um, it, it, it's very tasty tea used in moderation. Um, but I was not careful and I have some leaves of the creosote in my seeds. Now I can either go through and pick those all out or this goes into compost. Shame on me. Keep your work area clean. But I did show you a video of the um, moldy seeds because that's something that's very important um, when you are harvesting, foraging, anything, is to give yourself enough time to process this, whatever you're doing, fully. Um, in the case of the barrel cactuses, they do need to dry well. Because if it's got plant parts and juicy plant parts, it can get moldy. So that's why I dry them in the terracotta saucers. And that's why when I showed the video of them washing them and then I said oh life happened and they come back and they got moldy uh yeah they will get moldy and yes I did put them out for the animals to eat but the point is um, we're always encouraging you to harvest sustainably and so part of the sustainably is doing it in a fashion that you are going to use as much as you can of the plant and by the way when I showed you the bucket and I said, oh yeah, I went out and I harvest off of three uh, barrels and this is how much I got, like basically almost a full quart of seeds. Uh, there's about 20 barrel cactuses covered with fruit on my land. So I harvested three, but I left a lot for the animals that share this land with me. So do harvest sustainably and do give yourself ample time to fully process whatever you harvest when you go foraging. Thanks for watching. Savor the self. I think the camera is crooked. <laughs> Let's go work on that. Love her real.